What's going on everybody? This is Al from PlaybookGamer.com and in the last Dynasty video we took on Tulsa and ended up getting beat 37 to 21. It's technically our worst loss of the season. We've usually had some close losses throughout the year but ended up getting beat by 16 and nothing went right. We had turnovers, we had injuries, anything that could go wrong did which has kind of been a theme for a lot of our losses. But we got to get over it. We got two more games left. We're six and four. And the day we're going to take on Southern Miss, we're actually going to do a doubleheader. We're going to take on Southern Miss first. And then we're going to finish the regular season by taking a trip to Penn State. But back to Southern Miss. They're two and seven. That's going to help. They're doing something wrong, apparently. We got the same amount of talent as they do. It looks like offensively they are playing spectacular, but their defense is absolutely dreadful. But we got to play clean football. As you can see down here, our turnover differential isn't very good at all. But hopefully we can uh, boost that stat somewhat today. Now let's go over to recruiting. And one of the few positives we had in that last uh, game was we got a commitment from right tackle Kurt Johnson. This is a good pickup. We need help on the offensive line in the worst way. Very good chance he may be our starting right tackle next year or maybe our left tackle. Uh, just depending on how recruiting goes in the offseason. But we're glad to have him in the fold. And we are down to one guy left, Scott Brown. We got all of our points, percentage points, put on him. It is down between us, Tennessee, and Auburn. And I'd like to think putting all of our uh, points, all of our attention onto him is going to help us get this guy. It will help if we won today, though. So hopefully we can beat Southern Miss, secure that commitment, and be done with recruiting until we head into the offseason. All right, let's check out a few things. Let's go over to Sports Illustrated. Uh, bowl rankings, we can check out the top five or six. LSU, again, I think they're going to be probably win the whole thing. They've just been playing well all season. We gave them a good effort, a good try to beat them, but it just wasn't enough. Then you got USC, Virginia, Miami, and Florida, Iowa, Michigan, and so on and so forth. We can go to Heisman Watch. Uh, Deshaun Wynn of Florida, if I'm not mistaken, he won the how he's been in my Duke dynasty. So apparently Florida knows how to use their running backs and that the Urban Meyer spread option offense. Uh, Jamarcus Russell is right there, though. He's just having a great season. 37 touchdowns. We had a hard time stopping him uh, when we played him. It looks like Michigan, Iowa, West Virginia has a few guys on the list as well. Awards finalists were only up for one award, and that is the Thorpe Award. And Gooseby is still in the hunt, but he needs to, you know, probably get another interception or two and some tackles, force fumbles, anything to help his chances. But it's really cool that he is just in the final three. We are not up for any of the other awards, so we're not going to look at those. Bowl projections, at least we're eligible. We're six and four. We got two games left. I imagine they would have us. Looks like they don't have this anywhere at the moment. I'm not too worried about this. I mean, it would help if we get a win today over Southern Miss, get that seventh win to be done with it. But, I mean, I guess it's kind of possible we may not get in here. But, again, just win and don't worry about it, especially against Southern Miss. That looks to be our best opportunity. National Players of the Week, we can look at that. Uh, halfback from Vanderbilt had a really good game, and it looks like a defensive end from Ball State put up some serious numbers. Conference standings, we are done with the conference side of things in terms of us having a chance to win. We just kept losing too much, unfortunately. We're technically a game behind UTEP, but it's just it's over with because Tulsa beat us, Rice beat us. We can't get that tiebreaker, and Tulsa has already played all eight of their games. So we don't have to worry about that technically. Uh, what we can do is look at our team info screen. Now, injuries has been a big issue for us. Morris is out pretty much the rest of the year. Uh, our corner, I think our four-string corner, uh, Lumar has been out for quite a while. We've had a lot of uh, just in-game injuries in terms of only being out for the remainder of the game, thankfully. But it's hurt us in some of our losses. Now, Ricard, Forte, and Cooper, everybody's kind of doing their thing. Ricard had a really bad game. But, no, I take that back. He actually got hurt, I think, what, in the uh, second quarter? No, or was it Gidros? I already forgot. Either way, it's been the same dudes doing the same thing on the offensive side and defensive side with Gooseby, of course, leading in tackles. You never want your strong safety leading in tackles. You know, that is if you're running a 4-3. If it's a 3-3-5 or 4-2-5, then yeah, sure, that's not a big deal. Uh, but sacks-wise, Harrison's been leading that. He's been kind of stuck at five for quite a while. All right, let's go check out Southern Miss, see what we're dealing with here. 
They've had injuries themselves, uh, two tackles, a wide receiver. So they've had the offensive injury bug where it's been all defense for us. They got beat by Memphis by 10. Looks like their quarterback's putting up decent numbers. His touchdown to interception ratio is really good. Looks like they got a running back averaging over 100 yards a game or 110. That's pretty strong. A wide receiver putting up almost 100 yards. And they got a bunch of random dudes doing their thing on the defensive side. All right, I think we're ready to get into the game. Now, as you can tell, this is an unedited video. I'm kind of going to do things differently with my videos. I stopped doing the live stream. I didn't want to talk about that too much. But I'm going to do these just like normal videos like I've done in the past. But I'm going to do a double header. That's the one good thing I got from the live stream. I kind of like that idea. And what we're going to do is this is going to be a pretty long video. Where I'm going to do one big video a week. And I am going to make a bunch of clips off of this video. And I talk about all of that in one of the in the main comment for this video all right we have a home game let's see if we can get uh, our seniors off uh send them off right this is their senior day technically and what we can do is look at our seniors before we start the game ricard is one i think gidros is one again we'll check it here in a little bit I think, if I'm not mistaken, Southern Miss kind of runs a pro-style offense, 4-3 defense. But we'll check their roster and see what we're dealing with there. Would love to get that seventh win. Would really help us with recruiting and to secure a bowl game. That would be nice. And Ricard, I would like to see him have a good, clean game. He's just been off and on the last few games. It hasn't helped. He makes one great throw, and then another throw is bad. And they're picking us to win. Let's go to the coin toss. I like those uniforms, the way ones for uh, Southern Miss. Uh, we'll get the ball to start the second half. Let's check out our roster. I just want to check out our seniors more than anything else. Ricard is a senior. This is his last home game. Then you've got Fortes a junior, thankfully. Hopefully he'll be back next year. Gidros is just a junior, so I stand corrected. Uh, Brown is a senior. Let me see. Anybody else on the wide receiver front? No. Tight ends. We're playing nothing but freshmen there. Uh, Derek Rogers. We're going to miss him this year or next year, I should say. He's a senior. Uh, true freshman at left. Let's see. Uh, that is it for the, uh, the offensive side. Now, Morris, I hate that for him. This is a senior year. We can't do medical red shirts, unfortunately. Uh, Harrison, he's going to be gone as well, so we got to replace both of those guys. Defensive tackle, our entire front four on the defensive line is gone. Jack and Brown, it stinks, but it is what it is. It's part of the game. Uh, Peterson, out, left outside linebacker, he's gone. Then you got, uh, let's see, uh, that's it for the linebackers. Cornerback, looks like Foreman is gone after this year. Free safety, we've got a true freshman there. And Goosby is just a junior. Hopefully, he'll want to come back next year. We got a kicker and Beckman, but he never plays because our punter does both kicking and punting, and he's been fantastic for us all season. Maybe the MVP of the season so far. Everything he does is just does really well. So, it's really cool to see that, but I hate to see him leave. Uh, we're going to miss him next year. All right, let's check out Southern Miss and see what we're dealing with. Starting quarterback, 78 speed. That's a little worrisome. We'll see how much we'll blitz that guy. And the, his backup is another pretty much a dual threat. Impact halfback. This is what we're going to have to deal with. We just hopefully we can contain this guy. 80 behind him. Fullback, a really strong one. 87 overall, 78 speed. Uh, their top wide receiver technically kind of sort of is out. But they got an impact wide receiver too. So I don't know how balanced they're going to be because they got an impact wide receiver and halfback. I'm, I'm assuming they may run the ball a bit more because this guy's a little bit better overall wise. I don't know. We'll see. Tight end, 80, 70 speed. Can he catch? No. Uh, their left tackle is out for the year, but his backup is just as good, more or less. 84 at left guard, 82, 86, and 78. So they're kind of struggling at the tackle position. Uh, we'll monitor that throughout today. Uh, looks like they got a defensive in out for the game, and their backup, it's kind of a drop off, not too much. Right in at 74. 85 and 82 a defensive tackle, about like what we got. Linebacker, 72, 76, and an impact right outside linebacker. We'll try to stay away from him some today. Corners, 80, 76, and that is kind of it there. 
Free safety, 86 overall, 85 speed. Their backup is just a talented. Uh, strong safety, not so much. A 78, but he's got 90 speed. That's really fast for a strong safety. You don't see too many that are that fast, especially at, at our level in the Conference USA. They got a really good kicker, maybe the best kicker in the country, and an awful punter. So I assume that kicker probably does both uh, responsibilities. All right, let's get this show on the road. Hopefully we can play well in this one. They got both impact guys back there, so I am going to just kick it as normal as I can. And this one's going to one side. But looks like we're going to have a good touchback. I am going to play man for a while just to see how often they're going to run. Uh, I'll control a defensive tackle. I think they're going to run a little bit more than usual. Just a good play. Cover. We went man, but he beat. He went. Uh, I think somebody got stuck. You go back and look at this. Go back and look. I think somebody got stuck back there. They went with a switch route. And my linebacker couldn't keep up with him. They went three wide, so that kind of makes sense, too. All right, let's go cover two man again. I think they're going to run it. I can control this guy. This time, see what happens. Toss. Good juke, but nowhere to go. Good defense there. Barely get a yard. Uh, let's go. Uh, I'm going to stay here. I think they're going to run it again. I just want to keep everything in front of me until we get to a third down situation. I'm going to let Gooseby do his thing. I, I don't want to control him. The CPU handle him better than I could. Just a gaping hole. So this is something I'm going to monitor more. Everybody knows I maxed out the CPU sliders, but this is something I'm probably going to change. Um, it's just everybody got pushed back, like everybody. I think that's just kind of goofy. Uh, and the only way you can overcome that is just to have superior talent, and we just don't have that. But just having everybody got pushed, like you see right here, and this is just an observation. Everybody got pushed. So... That may be something I'm just going to change for next season, or I may do that for the next game. I'm going to see that how often that happens at this game. So that's the first one that, that was quite obvious. Uh, let's go. Uh, let's do a zone blitz to see if they go play action. Hopefully they will go play action. I'm very hesitant to blitz on this guy because I know he can run away from things. Just, oh, good play action. Complete. And now he's got room to run. Just another good run. Just good play all together. Uh, we can we can go nickel, cover two. And we got some okay talent in places, but it's been a real struggle for us this year for whatever reason. I think, I don't know. Just a gaping hole again. You go by, I'm just, again, I'm just checking this just to see if I'm missing anything. I'm just looking at this line. Everybody got a push. See, that's, again, that's probably why I'm going to back off the nine. I'm going to back off the run blocking slider. I'm, I'm going to bring it down at least some. That just, that's too consistent. And their offensive line isn't that great. It's about as equal as our defensive line, if that makes sense. So, again, I'm just going to monitor it more. The more I see that, the more I'll change it. But I'm not going to do that in game. We'll just we'll do that in between games. Going with the pass. Kind of wish I was going zone at the moment. Just a very lucky play. Very lucky play. Not so much that a bad throw ended up being a touchdown. That's kind of what happened there. He had to come back for it. So that was a very very easy drive. If I had inferior talent on defense across the board, I wouldn't worry about that so much. But yeah, we're about equal. It's not like they're loaded down with players or anything. We got the exact same amount of talent as they do overall. Especially up front. So we'll go back here. The goal here is I'm, I'm creating, I'm going to create a bunch of clips with these bigger videos and I want to be able to provide decent teaching moments on things and but I also want to try to keep things as realistic as possible uh, let's start off let me change this 
and then we'll do that and we can start off with gun trips we're going zone dime would love to run it but i'm not going to run towards the direction of that impact guy we'll just bounce it over to cooper good throw very good throw by ricard get a first down i wonder uh, we can stay here we can try speed option and they go in zone 4-3 this may not work we're going to try it though we can get decent blocking very fortunate good job by forte broke two tackles there somehow i didn't use the speed button or anything here i just i was just expecting us to get a, a loss right here but it didn't happen just ran through both of them just a great play by forte keeping the drive alive and let's reward him uh well let's go uh, i don't want to call that one let's go let's call this one let's go double screens we're going zone so this is going to go to forte they're blitzing hard that's going to help but the pass wasn't very good the pass wasn't good at all so that makes it what third and six yeah uh we will i think we can get the first down with this play but they're going zone ricard's gonna to have to make a good throw and we're at midfield i think i can get it with forte just enough good play so what we're going to do is we're going to back out of that for a while uh let's go let's go here let's do p read from spread they're going man and they're blitzing both inside guys so what i'm going to do and there's another strategy i got to use i just forgot to do it but we're going to try something here let's see if gidros can get it i think that's too far oh great play by gidros good job by the car i thought he overshot it ended up being a good throw great work good job by gidros you go back and look at this they went man and i can't show you now but what they had going was they had uh this guy i noticed and this guy i noticed was uh kind of looked like they were going zone but they were coming in uh to blitz of some sort that told me this guy was going to defend over here this guy was defending over there i had a post route with gidros and forgive me for having awful arrows and lines and such but i hot routed him to a go that was just a little bit of an easier cover zero beater and when you uh snap the ball you saw both safeties come down as you see right here he went down he went down this gives me a chance to go over the top to gidros ended up getting a really good play out of that as you see right here thankfully i had enough time to throw it and just a great throw to gidros even better catch too great play by the junior all right let's kick an extra point figure out what to do on defense i don't have any real answers on the running game especially if they're going to push us around every time so we got to hope for like a fumble of some sort maybe somebody can get through so if i was southern miss i would run the ball all day on us because again i'm not going to change sliders during the game i just don't want to do that i'd rather wait between games i want to be uh, fair about it do something like this uh let's see somebody get a stop how about that punter getting that kick or getting that block tackle good for him of course i was the one who controlled him but i don't get the tackle very often on special teams since i'm always controlling the kicker all right let's see what happens here they're going ace twins basic run and i gotta quit using i gotta quit using that free safety i'm not very good at it so here's another thing i'm just curious to see if everybody and their brother got shoved around on this one you look at the line everybody got pushed look at that just everybody so yeah uh, this will be the last time i'll do 99 on the uh run blocking but again I'll, I'll do that after the game i may end up losing because of it but just that's fine we'll go quarters just to do things a little differently they still may run it yep they're going to run it there and just another easy run again i'm just going to check this I just wanted to check it again just make sure if this was happening every so often i wouldn't be worried about it i wouldn't be talking about it so much you go around here and that's about normal i guess even though nobody was able to get through 
Uh, let's go cover two man. First and ten. Ball on the 33 yard line. Uh, let's do something like this. Comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna control defensive tackle. I'm trying to just get out of the way as best I can. I just got right on through again. Just ran right over my impact safety. And that's another thing. The running back ability jacked up the 99. I'm just asking to get killed. Just I'm just looking again. That was the draw, apparently. Oh, well. It's the great run. I'm not going to look at the replay. Don't want to see it. So we're down another touchdown. So it's just going to be a back and forth as long as I play clean football on offense. We're going to have to get lucky with them. They're going to have to turn the ball over or something. Because it looks like our defense ain't going to stop anything today, I'm afraid. Which is whatever. We'll get back on offense and see if we can get down the field. We'll pick another maybe formation or two. Uh, I think I'm going to just take a knee on this one. Uh, we're in the middle of the field, and their strong safety isn't the best in the world. So we can try cross up. We're going zone. Let's see if we can attack that safety. Uh, not feeling the heat at the moment. Good throw by Ricard. Pick up a decent game there. I'm actually going to try. We're going to stay in this formation. I am going to go with a wide receiver option. And they're going dime. Uh, we can go back and look at that. Uh, no, we don't have to. You've seen that a million times. I can go back and look at that later. I'm sure I'll complete that again. I want to have Gidros do something like that. I just want to get him out of the way. Good pitch. Great first down. Dang it. We was going to get an extra 15 yards there, but he stepped out of bounds. But that's okay. That's first and 10. Good play by Williams. Uh, let's go gun normal. Let's go tight end dig. They're going man, and they're shifting 4-3. Who is on our slot receiver? Looks like it's that linebacker. I'm going to bring him over. I have to throw that one kind of quickly. Get about five yards with Forte. Second and five, I think. I'm trying to find ways to give it to Gidro some more. Try your best to give it to your impact players. We're going zone on this one. We're going to go with a screen. Let's see. Great catch. Just didn't get the first. What I'm going to do here, uh, third and two. Uh, we can try direct. They're going man and they are blitzing. Uh, this ain't going to. This is going to be tough. That shift did not help things. I can't go to the left. Ooh, thankfully they didn't blitz. That helped. I was expecting that slot corner to blitz on me. It looked like he was going to. So we're at the 10. Let's go back to that screen, but we're going to do it from... No, let's go have a better idea. Let's go Y stick. Zone nickel. We got a few options. He's wide open, just not a very good throw. He had to come back for it. Uh, Eddie, uh, no, we got a couple more plays left, I think. Let's go speed option. Man nickel. But who's on who? Ooh. This is going to be interesting. Good deal. We're going to get six points out of that. All right, so we've tied it up. So it looks like we're going to have a high score in affair as long as both teams don't turn the ball over. Let's kick an extra point. If I had an answer for on the defense, I would try it, but nothing's coming to my mind. I don't know how to stop the offensive line thing other than change the slider, but I'm not going to. Not to, for this game. We'll do it for Penn State, though. And I'll probably lower the running back ability. We'll see. That's a strong kick. He may return this one, though. Impact, good. Took about third, the third guy to get him down. Uh, they're going three wide, but I'm going to go man. I can't go zone. I would love to try zone against the run, but it just never works. They just run right by you. Halfback direct there. Just 
Make a tackle somebody. Good job, Goosby. They get a couple. Uh, they're going three wide again, but I think they're going to run it. They're going a slotch. Hey, gaping hole right face mask. Ooh, they didn't call it. We got lucky. It looked like one. So it's third and long. This is a great spot here. We're going to try. We're going to go cloud. I'm going to do a spy with the left end. Because I think this quarterback will run with it if he feels any heat. Make a play, Gooseby. Just, I don't know how he caught that. Just a weird looking play. Oh, well, that was a waste, missed opportunity. Keep playing, though. Let's go here. That was just a weird animation. I can't get around that guy. Just another good catch. Uh, I'm going to just do a random zone blitz. I have a feeling they're going to score on us again. They're just making just great plays at the moment. Just left and right. It's second and short. They'll probably run it, I guess, won't they? So it's third and short. I don't think he got it. It says they're going go line. We're going to do the dog blitz. I'm going to try this method. Let's see. Uh, the strong side is this side, so we're going to shift everybody over. Uh, he got through, though. First down. Just a good push, I think, by everybody. Yep, everybody got a push, pretty much. I'm going to try another zone blitz. We got to throw something at him. I, we just kind of hope that he may pass it, and we may put enough pressure on him to where he may end up throwing a bad pass of some sort. Please don't run up the middle. They're doing the toss. Uh, another eight, nine yards. I have no answers for that. Let's go here. Let's do a cover one out of four, four. I'd love to try to use my defense tag, but I keep getting pushed around. Oh, he went play action. I dove first down. Again. Just six for six. Everybody's just making just perfect plays on their side of the ball without fail. Let's go cover two. It's first and ten, and this is the ninth play of the current drive. Southern Miss goes with the ace set here. Another easy four to five yards. Again, you can go back and look at this. I, I don't mind showing this a hundred times today if needed. Just kind of giving you my observation here. They went with that draw play. Still, nobody could shed a block on it. And I know they are, their line isn't as good as our defensive line. It's not like 10 times better. I'm going to go after him. Maybe we can make him throw a bad pick or something. Halfback dive and just went through everybody on that one. So it's what? Second and two. Third and two. They're going goal line. We'll try the dog blitz again. I think I've done that correctly. They still may be going to the opposite side, so I may have done that wrong. Went with that way. Went with a toss. Good deal. So that's a great stop. Kept him out of the end zone. So it is fourth and five. We'll go field goal safe, man. So that was initially the strong side. They motioned their tight end over, and we and they still went that direction. So that's food for thought. Kick is good. They can have all the field goals they want. So let's see if we can get on offense and try to overcome that. Let's see if we can get our first lead of the day. Southern Miss is ready to kick it away. Cooper and number 85 back deep to return. He kicks right down the middle. I'm going to let that one go. It's pretty deep as well. I'm going to go back to deep cross up. We're in a good situation for it. They're going man this time. I'm a little worried about that impact defensive end, or I think he's a linebacker. Yeah, he is. Not feeling the heat there. We're going to run. Let's just get out of bounds. I want him to get hit. There's no point in it. Oh, uh, let's try something. We have a gun under center. I'm going to see how our basic run game is from under center. We're going zone 4-3. Not a big fan of that shift. 
I'm going to cut up, though, like this. We'll just treat it like normal option. Great play here. They're going zone. So when you're going zone or when the defense is going zone, I'm just looking for just any type of gap of some sort. And if I can find one, I'm going to keep it with the quarterback. So when you snap it, like here, I notice my tight end got beat badly. So there's no point in me going around this way. So I just cut up and I'm just going to keep it the rest of the way. As you see here, at this point, I'm just trying not to, you know, get a fumble or anything. Just pick up whatever yards I can. But good play by Ricard. Uh, let's go. Let's try slam. We're going man. Let's see how they shift. Uh, I guess we're going to go to the left. They're blitzing everybody. Ah, got a few yards, not a whole lot. Where are we? We're on the, kind of in the middle of the field. Let's try another direct. Man nickel. It would really help if that linebacker moves over like that. That's good. That way we know who is on who. I'm going to bring this guy over, clear some space. We'll do a high snap here. Great play by Williams, the true freshman. Good juke. Right there. He's off to the races. So let's go. We're on the left hash. What I'm going to do... We're going to go wide receiver curls. The clock has stopped, so we're going to go ahead and snap this thing. They're going dime. Uh, they're going cover zero. I think that's too far. Yeah, I just didn't have enough room. That was worth the shot. Uh, second and ten. I'm going to try another speed option. I would love to do QB choice, but Ricard, I just don't think he's fast enough to handle it. Uh, I'm going to go to the left. I don't know if this is going to affect anything, moving him over. I snap does not help things at all. Get a block right there. How about Ricard? Going to break a tackle. And I think we got the first down. Wow, that was a great play right there. So I motion uh, the wide receiver over. I just wanted to simplify the numbers over here. And unfortunately, we had a bad snap, as you see right here. And at this point, I can't do any options. It's now just pure QB run at this point. But great block by Williams. He broke a tackle off of that dude and somehow got a first down. Just a great play by number eight. He's looking pretty good on senior day, which is good. I want him to succeed. Let's go to tight end dig. They're going zone. I am going to let that clock run. I want to give them as little clock as possible before we head to half. We got all three timeouts. I'm okay there. This is going to go to our tight end or to Cooper on the left. Get down to a couple of seconds. Just a bad throw by Ricard. Uh, we can go. Uh, let's do another toss. It didn't work the last time. Uh, they're going zone 4-3. Looks like we got no choice but to go to the left. Good play. Good play by the linebacker. That makes it what? We're on the five? Um, I would love to isolate. I don't think that's going to work. I don't know. Five yards is going to be tough as well. Oh, let's try tidy and dig again. I'm curious to see what they're going to do. They're going man. So this is going to be interesting. I don't know how this is going to work. We're going to let that clock go, though. I'm going to let it do its thing. I'm going to slant Brown. Have another pick. Action. We're going to do something like this. And we're going to get six points out of it. Good deal. I didn't know what was going to happen there. You go back and look at this. They were definitely going man. And I put Brown on a slant. I was hoping he'd pick one of these guys right here. I brought Cooper over to force this guy to defend my beautiful looking arrow there, Forte. And it ended up working out. I didn't know if somebody was going to come through and I couldn't get the ball off in time. But I was able to. Ended up picking up the touchdown. Whew. Okay. We're up three. Let's go up four. We do get the ball start of the third quarter. And he tacks on the 
They got 35 seconds left. Let's survive it as best we can. One of our weapons is our kicker slash punter. So I'm going to try to kick this as hard as possible. And this is going out of bounds. I hit the button way too early. Just way too early. They're going to get great field position. That was 100% on me. So that does not help things. I, he should be passing the rest of the way. So what we're going to do, I'm going to go quarters. I'm going to see if I can bait him into a, an interception of my end, or at least throw it in my direction. I just assume they're going to throw. Somebody almost got to him. It was close. So it's second and 10, I'm going to stay in quarters. Again, I think they're going to throw. They're going ace normal. If I was them, I would just run the ball and go to half. We're going to play action. Interception. Wow. Wasn't expecting that. Just a bad throw from what I could tell. Was he feeling the heat? Looks like he was feeling the heat right there, and he threw it off his back foot. Good job. So who made this the, uh, the interception? Go back here. Peterson. Good job. So that means we can actually get some more points before the half. Let's go slot cross. They're going man. I'm going to try to dump this over to Cooper. They never go cover zero, so it's going to go to Cooper. Yep, they're going to end up go with a spot. Let's call a timeout. Uh, we're on the... Uh, let's get Forte in there. Let's play that safe. Let's go P. Reed. Going zone dime. I'll probably just throw this to him. Hopefully we can get the... Get out of bounds. Just get it. Get out of bounds. Get a first down. Uh, let's do the same thing with curls. They're going man, and they're going nickel. I'm going to hot route Gidros to a go just in case. They're going cover two, so we're going to bounce this over. Great catch. Let's get out of bounds with Williams. Second and three. I'm trying to think of ways still to get to the sideline. Let's go with, where's that screen? Let's go halfback screen. So this is zone, so this is going to go to a forte. We'll bounce this over to him. Third and one. Uh, let's go do this. I want an ISO play with Gidros. But they're going zone, so we're going to bounce this to Forte. Just try to pick up the first. Hopefully we can get it. If not, we may have to kick the field goal. High snap. I didn't get it. Dang it, I didn't get it. Ah, oh, man, I didn't get it. Let's call a timeout. One second. You go back and look at it. That was super close. High snap forced me to run. I had to throw it off my back foot. Forced a short throw. He technically, that's a first down right there. But I, technically, I guess it's not. All right. So let's kick the field goal. And we'll go up seven. I'm glad I paid attention to the clock there. Otherwise, we would have went to half and I didn't realize it. Hopefully, I can make this one. Go something about like this. Perfect kick right down the middle. Good deal. All right, we're up a touchdown. Our defense played a whole lot better towards the end. We forced a field goal, and we got an interception. 24 to 17. Let's go to the stats. 214 to our 254. So offensively, both teams are kind of doing their part as long as they don't turn the ball over. 120 on the rushing and 134 for us, but their running is really good. They got an impact running back. It helps. Both teams were playing fantastic on third down. They had the one big turnover, and we took advantage of it. We got some points out of it. Let's go to individual stats. Uh, 199 uh, on the QBR rating, uh, or the QBR. Uh, 14 to 16, two touchdowns, uh, no picks. Ricard is playing excellent on his senior day. Running the ball. He's got 49 yards. It's just kind of working out for him. It's just kind of whatever the defense gives you. Him and Williams, we've kind of split the carries, but it's just another bad day for Forte on the running. That's been like that for the last several games. They've just done real well locking him down on things. Receiving, Forte already has eight receptions, but only 28 yards out of it. That's a very low average in terms of receiving. 
Uh, but we got a touchdown from him. We got a touchdown from Gidros over the top. Defensively, Gooseby, again, he's leading at tackles. Tackles for loss, Stamper. We don't have any sacks, but we did have a forced interception, uh, which was going to be a sack. Peterson was able to get that one. All right. Let's head back into the third quarter. It would be amazing if we can get a touchdown on this drive. Go up two scores. That may go out of bounds. No, he's going to take it. Uh, get a block, somebody. Get a block, somebody. Get a block, somebody. Get a block, somebody. How about Cooper? Great play right there. Let's see if they show us a good instant replay. That was just a great, great play all around. Uh, all right, we're on the right hash. I'm going to go PE rollout. It's on my mind. We're going zone. I'm going to attack that strong safety. He is a weakness. Let's see if we can go after him. Cover two. Ah, poor Brown. Just dropped it. Actually, he didn't even attempt to catch it, which isn't good. Just a burnt. Ah, that was touchdown right there. That's okay. Uh, let's go. Let's do a toss. We're going man 4-3. I am going to go to the right. I'm staying away from that linebacker on this one. He came in. That helped. Good pitch. Get a first down with Williams. We can stay in this formation. We're on the 27. We're going to go with tight end streaks. We're going man. Very good chance we'll go to either right or Gidros, depending. I'm going to hot route. Kessler, just so he doesn't get him. Ah, oh, they went off sides. I kind of wish they didn't do that. <laughs> I'm going to call this play and now watch him go zone. We'll take the the yards. We'll call the same play. We'll go tight end streaks. Okay, we're going man again. So we're going to do the exact same thing. I'm going to give Wright as much ISO room as possible. We'll have him come down. Looks like they're going to cover one, so we'll go to Gidros. Just get a first down. Good play there. Let's go. Um, let's go here. I would love to do basic runs, but our offensive line just isn't the best in the world, so we're going to keep going to the outside. Let's do another toss. This time with Forte. I'm going to just toss this one. I probably should have kept that. We could have done more option with that. That's okay. A second and eight. Uh, let's go RB deep. We're going zone, so we're going to pass this over to Cooper. That's our only real zone beater. Get up field. Ah, just, he got bogged down, so that is what? Third and four? I will probably... Let's go tiny dead. We're going to flip this. And they're going zone. This should be interesting. I don't know if we can get the first. He'll be close. Had to throw it off the back foot. And we're very fortunate that wasn't picked. Very lucky there. Somebody came through. If you go back and look at this, somebody came through. And I got spooked. Yeah, I had to throw it. Throw it off the back foot. Good defense. I think we got to kick the field goal. I think just, let's play it safe. Let's just get some points. Be done with it. Next time on that drive, I'll probably go with a run, like a speed option, let Ricard handle it or something like that. Just a good kick. Good job by our punter slash kicker. So now that gets us up 10. A lot of missed opportunities on that drive, but we still got some points out of it. All right, let's get back on defense. A much straighter kick than the last time. And I think he'll take a knee. And he will. I'm going to go back to man, cover two. I think they're going to start running it some more. If I was them, that's what I would do. we got ace trips in their playbook. Just everybody got pushed on that one, I could tell. Fumble. Oh, they got super lucky there. They got the fumble back. You go back and look at this. I just kind of noticed everybody and their brother got a great push. Look at that. Everybody got pushed back two or three yards. That just happens too consistently for me. Either way, almost had the fumble. Almost got a recovery here. It takes about two to three hits to do it. It was a 15 Peterson. He's been all over the place today. But they still end up getting their first down. So let's just stay in 
cover two man. It's first and ten. Ball on the 30 yard line. Uh, we'll do something like this. And the man at uh, I'm not a this is mm, don't run to the left. Dang it, I got bogged. I got clipped. No, I didn't get clipped. I got stuck on the guard again. Just another easy first down. We'll go. I'm going to stick with this. I'm going to go back to playing free safety just for a little bit. Hopefully, I don't mess this up. I'm, I'm useless playing defensive tackle. I get pushed five yards every time down the field. Just another broken tackle. And that's why they need to run it every time because we can't stop it. Everybody, again, here's another reason. I hate to bring it up, but I want to. It's just how I want to do it. You go back here. Everybody got pushed. Look at all this. Everybody got pushed three yards back. Everyone. So we're going to be very fortunate we can come out here with a victory having to go up against that. Let's do something like this. I'm going to try zone blitz. Just throw something different at him. Please don't go up the middle. QB draw. Perfect play call. Perfect play call. Fumble it. Fumble it. Somebody get it. Dang it. They got it back. We're getting lucky on those. Very lucky. Uh, let's go cover one. Let's not throw on the way to scoring. Uh, let's do something like this, maybe. Just, just nobody touches him. Fumble again. Dang it. Uh, and yeah, we'll just stay. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Again, I think they're going to score here. Unless we get lucky off a turnover. Play action. Somebody get to him, though. Ooh, out of bounds, thankfully. Thankfully, thankfully. Uh, they're going... It says they're going goal line. We're going to go with Dog Blitz. And I'm going to leave it as is. I'm still going to stay. We're going to do... Yeah, we're going to do something. I think they're going to go to the right. They may buck the trend and go to the left. And they went to the right. Awesome. They did go to the right. It didn't matter if they moved or tied in or not. A huge stop. So we're going to force the field goal. So it's been a field goal battle in this quarter. They got a lefty kicker. You don't see that too often. Even though he's, oh, yeah, I think he's the real talented one. And I think they got the bad punter. Gets us back down to seven or up to seven. We'll go right back down and see if we can score a touchdown. I'm going to let that one go. I'm okay with that. All right, middle of the field. I'm going to try to take advantage of it if we can. Let's go deep cross up. Zone dime. Let's see if we can execute this the last like we did last time. Not a big fan of that shift. High snap does not help things, but he went in. Great catch by Cooper. Whew. The high snap messed up the entire thing, but we was able to come out alive. If Ricard couldn't run the ball, that would have been a sack. Just a great play by Cooper. Keeps it going. I am. Let's try slam. I don't know if our offensive line can handle it. I mean, this is the reason why you haven't seen me call this too much this year. Just our offensive line, as you can see, it's just not very strong. I'm going to go to the right. I'm trying to set up that play action play. Just nothing. Just nowhere to go. Second and eight. We can try the play action now. And they're going man. I'm going to hot route this tight end to block. Just to give us some help here. Cover one. Ah, oh, just not a very good throw. So that makes it what? Third and eight. Uh, we're going to try tight end cross. Okay, they're going man. Can we get a first down by throwing it to Gidros here? If they go cover zero, they're going cover two. Nope, short armed it. Just a short he short armed it. Unfortunately. So what I'm going to do is we're going to try something here. Uh, we're going half back direct. They're going zone nickel. That's not what I wanted to see. Uh, and there's, I'm going to try it though. First down. 
they spread out. Thank the Lord they spread out. So you see all their entire defensive line spread out. I'm just going to cut through here and just try to pick up the first down. And thankfully, we was able to do so. Just get thankful there wasn't a high snap. Oh, my gosh. That would have been terrible. Shoot. So that was a gutsy call. So let's stay here. And let's call something else. Let's go white corner. We're going zone. Ooh. We may have to keep this one simple. Ah, good play. Good throw. I don't think he got the first, though. Oh, he did. First and 10. Uh, we're going to stay here, and I am, let's see. I'm going to do that, and I'm going to do a quick audible. We may try it here in a minute. Let's go wide receiver curls again. We're going zone nickel, so we're going to keep this one. Ah, just a bad throw. Good cut right there by Cooper. Great play. And he fumbled it, but he got out of, out of bounds. Whew, that was wild. Uh, so you go back and look here. Zone, the bad throw, but I was able to make a cut to get around that guy. Great play by the freshman receiver. Let's go. I'm going to go right here. We're going to go with a halfback dive from gun normal. Let's get Forte going if we can. They're going 4-3. Uh... Good push by everybody, though. That helped. Let's do a stiff arm. Let's just pick up a first. Good play there. I saw that left line, left side of the line do a pretty good job. This You see right here. Ah, my bad, my bad, my bad. You go back, look here. And just that left side of the line got a good push. That helped. We're on the six. I'm going, we're on the, let's just do a basic slam. I think they're going to, they're going zone dime. Let's take advantage of that. I'm going to run to the right. And this impact receiver is looking to make I'm going to have to bounce this out. Just get a touchdown. Good for Forte getting in the end zone via the run and not getting to catch all the time. Great play there. And that gets us up two touchdowns. I had to bounce out to the outside by right tackle and tight end. Didn't get the push I needed. But at least they didn't uh, have their defenders shed the blocks either. So let's kick the extra point, go up 14. Let's get back on defense and keep holding the field goals. That would be great. I'm going to kick it as far as I can. This should be a really strong kick. I don't think he will return it. And he won't. So they're, only, they're down two scores, but there's still plenty of time left. So I'm going to go back to man. And we're going to do this. And let's see what happens. Just, this ain't good. Somebody get him. I'm going to let... Just a huge gain. Well, that's a basic talk. Just great block on the outside on that one. I'm going to take a chance on the zone blitz. They've been occasionally doing play action. Maybe we can catch them on one here. Looks like I might have to do it like this, though. Intercept that, Gooseby. Intercept that, Gooseby. Great play by 18, our best defender. Threw it right to him. Are they going to show the instant replay? Yes, they will. Just a great play by the Goose. Oh, man. Awesome. Good for him. That's huge. Let's take advantage of it, can we? Uh, let's let's do a toss. Man, four three. I really want to get Forte going on the ground if I can. They're moving that way. I'm still going to run in this direction. Everybody picked up their block. That's good. Let's go, Forte. Get your juice going. Get that speed. Now I want to check hours. Here's what I want to do. I want to go over here and bring this out, and I want to see what our line done. Our line got a good push, too. Interesting. And I got mine, like, set at 50, I think. For the most part, everybody got a pretty good push. Uh, do, do, do. He is kind of gassed. I kind of messed him up there. Uh, so we... Uh, let's go... Yeah, let's go gun spread again. Let's go white stick. They're going zone, nickel. My preference, actually, is for them to go man. So I'm going to let that clock roll out. And we'll go into the fourth quarter. We'll probably call it the same thing. Or I think I may go back to Forte some more. 
I'm gonna go back to trips over. We can run PA read. All right, that was a good quarter for us. We're up two scores, two touchdowns specifically. So let's finish this thing off. Let's get a win. It's been a while. Zone dime. I would love to run it. But I just don't trust that guy. Everybody shifted on that side. It's just not worth it. So let's just go ahead and get a quick toss over here to Cooper. I don't think he got in. Uh, he did. Uh, they got six yards, just enough somehow. We'll stay here and I'm going to do QB choice, but I will probably hand the ball off. Zone nickel. Yeah, we're just going to hand the ball off. Good job, Forte. Good juke. Get a first. So Forte is close. Him and Williams, they've been splitting it. He is kind of gassed. Let's go back to Williams. Uh, we can go back to here. That's fine. Now let's go slot seams. Man 4-3, but who is on who? So I'm either going to go to Wright or to Cooper. I'm not going to go to or Wright or Gidro. So I'm not going to go to Cooper. That impact guy is on him. So let's see what that other safety does. They're going to cover one. So we'll just go to Gidros. Good tackle by the corner. Didn't get a whole lot on that one. Second and seven. Uh, let's just stay here and do speed option. Man nickel. Who's on who? He's on him. Good. That means I'm going to bring this guy over. And maybe we can get a decent gain on the left. Now, what I'm going to do is run clock. I think it's smart to do this. I just want to keep it away from them, give them as little time as possible to try to make a comeback. Because all it takes is for me to turn the ball over right here and they're right back in it. And I'd rather not have to deal with that. Good pitch there. Just don't fumble it. Good play. Now, what we can do here is, oh, it's third and two. Uh, do, do I have a... I got QB choice. Uh, we'll go curls. Man nickel. We don't have a whole lot of room to go over the top, I don't think. So I'm going to keep this one simple and probably just bounce this to Williams. The clock is stopped. So we can go ahead and... He's wide open. Wide open. Great play. Six points. Whoever was defending him, I don't know. We can go check this. So they're going man. The only reason, again, why I motion this receiver over is because they are going uh, nickel, which means I am originally this guy was on Williams. I want this guy to be on Williams and motion and the wide receiver forces that guy to come over and defend him. But it looks like that free safety was the one who defended him. Nope, it was the linebacker. You go back and look at this. We can zoom back in. As soon as I snap the ball, watch this guy right here. As soon as I snap it, he's the one defending him. He is chasing him down. The problem is he bumped into his own defender, his own teammate, and he couldn't get over there. And another pick. Looks like Cooper picked on him too. You see right there. Picked on him, and that's why he has all day a whole lot of room to make a play. Just an awesome, awesome play to Williams. Just like that, we're up three touchdowns. Let's be breathe a little bit. Let's kick that extra point. I hope I can get that one in. That one was kind of iffy. We'll get back on defense where we are just playing great. And I think what's helping, we're not getting sacks on the guy, but his two interceptions is him throwing off the back foot, getting pressured. So we're going to continue to do that. At this point, you think they're going to throw the rest of the way. I actually want him to uh, just sit back there and pass. I know that's not his strength. I'm going to go to quarters here. I want him to just sit back there. I don't think he's good enough to just pick us apart. So we're going to try that. And they're still going to run the ball. Why? I don't know. Maybe because of that guy right there. Maybe that's why. I still think they're going to pass some, though. I'm going to try a zone blitz. This may be a good chance to do it. I always like to do it against 11 personnel. I'm going to try this. Right, let's do something like this. Calling an audible or something. Oh, great play by the quarterback. Just a great play. He dodged it. Go back and look at this. They're going to show a good replay of this one. 
Gooseby just got beat on it. I think he tried to swat it down. No, he didn't even do anything. Look at this quarterback. He made a great play right here. You see me coming right there? Went right by me. Ah, oh, just moved up just enough. That's a huge play for them. They're going to call something goofy here, I think. Just some run of some sort. They must be waiting for somebody to get back to the line. Everybody's on the line. There they go. Yeah, just calling a basic run. Good stop. Good job by defense tackle. I'm going to go back to that zone blitz. Keep that clock running. Good play. Good throw. He read the blitz. So it's what? Third and two. I am... Mm. Let's go, Cloud. It's third down and two to go. Sheaves, Shives, Sams, whoever that is. With three wide receivers. I am going to do a spy. I think they're going to pass it. <laughs> Who knows? They can call anything at this point. Play action. Ooh, bad throw. Tight end didn't come back around in time. Fourth and two. They're going to go, apparently, goal line. I'm going to try that dog blitz again. Let's see if they go to that strong side. I'm going to shift everybody over. Oh, they just got a good push. Can we uh, get it? Somebody get a stop. I don't think he got it. Yes, he didn't get it. Great stop right here. I think we was able to get a good push. Well, they actually, everybody got a good push. They just had nowhere to go. Awesome. Huge play right there. Just nowhere to go. And that may have done it. Let's do a basic... Mm, let's do a dive. I'm going to try to run clock. Get us out of here. Hey, we got a good push there, too. Again, I want to look... And I have mine again set at 50. Go back and look at this. Everybody got a push. Man, look at that. And you go back and look at my... My sliders are always on the website. I got the link above. Um, I have my run blocking set at 50. I've never touched that ever. But even we get a push. I kind of like to see that some of the defensive lines get through somehow, but they never do. It, or they don't do it as often. It's second down and four to go. Ball on their own 19. They are shifting hard that way. I'm still going to run to that side. I just don't want that linebacker to make the play. If I went to the left, he probably will. So I am, I'm just going to run to the right. They had a much better push there. I don't know if you saw it or not. They had a much better push right here. On the right side, we got pushed back pretty badly. First and 10. He is gassed. We're going to have to go to somebody else. Let's just stay under center. Let's go halfback Reed with Williams. We're going, man. I'd love to go and uh, run behind my best Offensive lineman, which is my left tackle, but not with the impact guy sitting there. It's not worth it. So we're going to go to the right. We're going to continue to run clock and end this thing. I'd like to get about one more first down and end it officially. Somehow Williams didn't lose five yards. He lost 10, or he didn't lose any. We're back to second and 10. Let's do a counter while Forte recovers some more. Man nickel. I am going to go to the left. We're going to try this. Hopefully that linebacker doesn't cause any chaos. But we're going to run to the left. I think they've given up officially. They're not calling timeouts or anything. I will probably run it again on third down if we don't get a first here. Oh, good play by the linebacker. And the fumble. Ooh, we got lucky. He just shed that block way too easily. I think my tight end got beat badly too. Of course, tight ends aren't meant to be like the greatest blockers all the time, so that doesn't shock me. Third and 11. He's gassed. Uh, all, both of my guys are gassed. Uh, let's just go speed option. Maybe Ricard can make the run instead. So Ricard is your MVP of the game. I think so. I think he done a, had a fabulous day. So they're shifting that way. Their impact linebacker isn't even out there. So we're going to do something like this. We're going to go to the left. No high snap. That helped. And we're going to just get down. Here you go. And that's it. Ball game. 41 to 20. 
So, you know, throughout the game, I, I, I mentioned how I was one to adjust the sliders. I I still may not do that because we our defense still kept him out of the end zone a lot during the game. We're going to do a QB kneel. So I think I'll, I'll just leave it as is. I just want to point that out to you why sometimes the opposing team just can do whatever they want to in the run game, especially when they get such huge pushes. But you saw our uh, offense got a push or two as well. So maybe it just all evens out in time. I don't know. Snap it. And that should do it. So we got back in the win column. We're seven and four. That should guarantee us a bowl game somewhere. Don't know where, but it will be somewhere. So let's check out some stats. Good for Ricard. We'll definitely check out his here in a minute. Thank you for tuning in to this contest of NCAA football 2006. Let Kirk and Brad do their thing, and we're going to check out some numbers. I didn't want to look at the depth chart. I want to look at stats and scores. 380 to our 459. I thought the second half we just played a little bit better defensively. Uh, our third down looked pretty good. Their two turnovers is pretty much what done it in for them. We didn't have any turnovers. That helped. So that's what I said at the beginning of the video. Turnover differential. We got to improve on that, and we've done that today. No doubt. Oh, uh, let's go to individual. 23 of 28, three touchdowns, no interceptions, 233 yards there, and he ended up with 60 yards on the ground, which is way more than what he usually does. I try not to run him too much because he only has like 72 speed, but good to see him just have a great game. And he got a touchdown to boot. So he ended up what, getting four touchdowns total. By far, I guess his best game of the season, maybe the best game of the dynasty so far. Cooper, eight receptions, 118 yards. Forte, eight receptions. Gidros had four and a touchdown. Forte had a touchdown. And Larry Williams had a touchdown. You go to defense. Uh, Gooseby had a pretty good game overall. Nine tackles, and he ended up having an interception. Peterson had the other interception as well. Uh, Stamper with two tackles for loss, no sacks. And again, Peterson and Gooseby with the two picks. You go to the box score. It just slowly turned in our uh, favor, especially when you look at the second half. We got more points in the third and in the fourth. Excellent. All right, let's get out of here. So this is unedited. You normally don't see this part of the show and whatnot. Uh, but what we're going to do is we're going to simulate the rest of the week. And uh, we're going to save it. And then we're going to play our next game, our final game of the season. So let's get out of here. Let's sim this, see what happens. Speed this up a little bit if I can. Oh, I don't think it's doing it. Let me try this. There we go. I think we're going to get that commitment. We're about to find out here in about five seconds. And we still didn't get that commitment. I think he may have gone elsewhere. Uh, either way, we got Penn State coming up. Now, what we can do is check out the top 25 for the week. Just want to make sure I'm doing that correctly. Yes. Texas Tech, A&M, then you got Colorado, Florida State over Florida. That was an upset. Then you have a USC over UCLA, uh, Ohio State over Michigan, Iowa, and you got, uh, look at that score, 6-3. to three. Virginia Tech won that one, and I guess an upset. Then you have Oklahoma, Wake Forest, Tennessee, Georgia. Then you have uh, Oregon State and Ole Miss over LSU. Wow, LSU. Got beat. That's big. Wow. Wasn't expecting that. All right. Let's go and save it. Let's get that one out of the way. And then we're going to check out recruiting. I think that center may have went somewhere else. I hope I'm wrong. Uh, we're still got 100 points dumped into them. Uh, let me get this. Okay. Go here. Let's check out. Oh, yeah, we got to say one more thing. So this is technically live, but without the live stream, as we all know, I, the live stream doesn't work well for me. I, I can concentrate better, do what I want to do and such. Uh, let's go and we'll go to play week first. Let's, we got to talk about the game we got coming up now. Can't say they're 5-5. Five and five. Now, they got more talent than we do. Looks like they run the ball pretty well. I know they run like a pro-style offense, but if they got a running quarterback, they'll probably use him some. Looks like their defense isn't doing a whole lot. Uh, but it's been a long time since I played Penn State, and this is one of the reasons why I picked them and put them on the schedule. I wanted to go to Happy Valley. I figured that'd be a fun environment to play in. Uh, let's go to recruiting. And unfortunately, 
as I expected, that center just decided to go elsewhere. We dumped 100 points on the guy. We put all of our attention to him. We won, and we still couldn't get him. So he's going to Tennessee instead. So we're, we got to find a center of some sort in the offseason because that's our biggest weakness on offense is the, our interior line. So we are done recruiting until we head to the offseason, which should be in the next video with that bowl game. Let's go to Sports Illustrated. Uh, bowl rankings, uh, USC, Miami, Iowa, Colorado, and then LSU. LSU pretty much knocked themselves out of it unless something crazy happens with some of these other teams, but I don't think that's going to happen. You got a Heisman watch. Uh, looks like the halfback from West Virginia is putting up all kinds of yards and touchdowns and numbers. Uh, Jamarcus Russell went down, I guess, after that loss. That did not help. Florida getting beat by Florida State. That didn't help them either. So it does help if you win some games to go uh, with some big stats. You go to awards finalists. Again, we're only looking at Gooseby. He did get, if I'm not mistaken, there he is. He picked up another interception, and he had, what, eight tackles? He may end up sneaking in here and getting this trophy, which would be really cool. We'll find out at the beginning of the next video. Well, we'll go to bowl projections. Uh, sorry, bowl projections. I assume we are on here somewhere. You would think they would put us somewhere. Looks like they don't have us anywhere. I feel quite confident we're going to go to a bowl. We're at 7-4. Even if we go 7-5, we should be going somewhere. Players of the week. Let's see who put up some crazy stats. Looks like the halfback, the wolf kid. I'm quite positive he's an impact guy. 162 yards, four touchdowns, and two through the air. That's very impressive. Then a middle linebacker. Had four tackles, but an interception, a forced fumble, a touchdown. And he's a true freshman, too. Good for him. Uh, conference standings, again, we're kind of done with this. Uh, we're out of it officially. Looks like UTEP is going to win the division, even though we beat them, which hurts my heart, but that's okay. And here's our team info screen. Everybody's been doing their same thing. Of course, Morris and Lumar, they're after the rest of the year. Ricard had a great game against Southern Miss. Forte, Cooper. And you got defensive leaders, Gooseby, again, leading in tackle, leading in interceptions. And Harrison is still stuck at five on the sack front. Let's check out Penn State. Let's go over to the Big Ten. And they are all the way down here, apparently. We'll go here. Uh, halfback, injury-wise, they got a halfback out. I don't know if he's their starter, though. Uh, they got a tackle out. We'll find out if he's a starter. They destroyed Penn State in their last game. Looks like Anthony Morelli, if anybody remembers him, he was a hot shot coming out of high school and just didn't do a ton at Penn State. But I think he was a Pennsylvania guy, which uh, one of the big things I remember about him. 18 touchdowns, 9 picks. Uh, running, they got one guy putting up over 90 yards. Looks like uh, Darren, is that Devin Williams? Darren Williams? He was the number one player in high school. I remember him, the little wide receiver. Could do a little bit of everything. Uh, he was like a Percy Harvin type. Defensive leaders? They got one guy, Pasluzny, I hope I said that correctly, leading in tackles and in sacks. And they got uh, Justin King. Well, I remember all these dudes. King was their other big-time recruit. I think he was a five-star kid. He's like a cornerback, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, he's leading their team with three interceptions. All right, like I said, I, I don't think I'm going to touch sliders. We're not going to deal with that. But I'm still going to monitor some more of it as we go along. So let's go ahead and keep this one going. We'll speed this up. We don't have anybody in trouble, so we'll dive into it. Hopefully, we can have a decent showing today. I'm going to keep my expectations super low. Again, they got more talent than we do, and if they got, like, some impact dudes in the backfield, it's going to be a tough battle. Unless we get lucky with turnovers and such, like we did with Southern Miss. We got a pretty day for football. Clear skies. We'll see if there's any harsh wind. Great looking. Oh, I enjoy this stadium. It's been so long since I've played in it. Cold, and look at the wind. I'll try to remember that when we throw deep if we ever do, but that wind is super harsh. It's super cold. You can see a lot of long sleeves on today. I wonder what their uniforms are going to look like. They really haven't had to adjust them. I figured they wouldn't. I mean, Penn State hasn't changed their uniforms in years, and I'm glad they have, and I think they look really good. I didn't know what the next mod, of the textures, that anything would have changed, but no, not really. They still look really good, though. That's a great place to start a dynasty. They're just okay at the beginning of this game. Back in 2005, they were just kind of there. And they're picking the Nittany Lions. Let's go to the coin toss. They won it, and they will. 
kick it. So we're going to get the ball first. Uh, let's do that. Let's check out their roster. Starting quarterback, Anthony Morelli. He is a pocket passer, thankfully. The guy behind him is not. He's a true freshman. Oh, we would love to have him. Uh, so we're going to blitz this guy. But this is what we got to deal with. Another impact halfback, 92 overall, 89 speed. We're going to just try to keep everything in front of us as best we can. A really good fullback. He's got decent guys behind him. Wide receiver, Derek Williams. That's his name, Derek Williams. He's a first-teamer. And uh, just a 92 overall, 98 speed, just a little uh, jitterbug. He's not the biggest guy, but they got some decent talent behind him. Uh, tight end, 82, 80. Both these guys can run a little bit. They can catch a little bit. Uh, offensive line, 97. Levi Brown, 97 overall, 80, 80, 76, and 76. And that guy's out. So their offensive line isn't all that great. Everybody's in the 70s except that massive dude right there. So I'm curious to see how much push they'll continue to get today. Again, I think they run a 4-3, 78-82 on the ends, 89-82. So their defensive tack or uh, defensive line is just fine. Outside linebacker, Paul Puslesny. We're going to stay away from him as best we can. This guy does everything for them. 85 at middle linebacker. And an imp, Dan, big Dan Connor. I forgot he played at Penn State. I remember him. Uh, anyway, another impact guy. They always had great linebackers back in the day. And they still probably do. They're always been known as linebacker U. Uh, cornerback, again, Justin King, true sophomore. That He came in at the same time as Derek Williams. Uh, Knowledge Timmons, that's a great name. 78, 76, so at least he's not an impact guy, so we can still probably go after him, even though he's pretty talented. Free safety, 78. A strong safety, and 88. Okay. Uh, kicker, 78, and 84 at punter. All right. Let's get this show on the road. We do get the ball start of the game. This is a cool end of the year game, I think. Just going up to a random place we don't normally play at. Uh, get up. Not much there. We're on the left hash. I want to make my one adjustment. I'm going to do that there. Uh, let's go. We didn't call this play any last time. Let's go P.E. Reed. Very intimidating to see two impact linebackers like that. I'm definitely not going to run it. fumble out of the gate out of the gate they blitz up the middle my center i guess just nope it was through the left side just an awful play great play by the linebacker just like that they're fixing score on us i couldn't get the ball off in time i tried i just couldn't well that's not the start you want uh let's just do a zone blitz they should score on this one So as I said at the very beginning, don't turn the ball over. And what do we do? Very first play, fumble. Come out with split back. He drops back. Let's it go. Complete. I think he lost the yard. That's a pass. Uh, let's go with man on this one. I think they're just going to keep it simple. Go to the run. Go to 26. Good job, Bale. I was able to get around the guard. So it is third and eight. It would be a miracle if we can hold him to a field goal. Let's go Cloud. I'm going to go after him. The right tackle. I know they're going out tw twins. Surely they're going to pass it. Just can't get around the guy. Great defense. I think he swatted it down. Yes, I think that was route. Able yeah, to get a swat on that one. Great play. They probably could have been caught, too. So we avoided an absolute disaster here. Hopefully they don't fake this. Actually, they went field goal block. I want them to do safe, man. Here we go. They'll try to make this a field goal game. It's up. And they made it. So that could have been much worse, but they did gain a possession. Let's get back on offense, and we're going to have to do things quickly, like those play actions. It's going to be, I'm going to have to keep those pretty, uh, run those sparingly, I'm afraid. So we're back on the left hash again. Let's see. Deja vu here. Just nobody blocked on that one. We can try. Let's spread them out. And will they use both linebackers? They got one out there. Man nickel. Go over here. 
cover one will go to williams uh good yeah great play by the linebacker i threw that one a little too lightly but that's okay second and two let's spread them out some more let's go stick they still got the one out there we're going to go to one of the outside receivers. I'm going to run clock. I know that's kind of boring, but I feel like that's our only chance to win this one. Just keep it away from them. If we can chew up as much clock as possible, that'd be great. We'll get us down to a few seconds, and I will probably be throwing this to Gidros unless they go cover zero, and we can go to Brown instead. They're going to cover one. Good throw to Gidros. Pick up the first. Uh, let's back out of here and let's go to a play I haven't called in a while. Let's go halfback angle. They're going zone and they brought back their other dudes. I may need to go back to the four wide stuff to keep him off the field. It just increases our chances of him not being out there. This will go to Forte or Cooper depending on what those linebackers do. The rest of my routes are all man beaters. Here pick up four maybe four or five second and six we could try a speed option from spread and they got both of them out there i knew that was a matter of time before that would happen and they're going cover zero but they shifted that way that kind of gives us a little bit of a chance that dude is gonna be right on me that linebacker that's right across from our quarterback so i'm gonna have to pitch this quickly Let's go ahead and snap it. Ooh, he got caught with the center. Just don't fumble it. Get a first down with Williams. So we kept the drive going. Let's go trips. Oh, uh, where's it at? Uh, let's go double screens. They're going zone. I'm just trying to think of ways to mitigate their linebackers. I'd love to see both of them blitz. But we're going to go to Forte on this one. It would help if they blitz kind of hard, but maybe we can still get away from it as long as there isn't a high snap. We're going to keep that clock running. Come back out here. Dang it, he got stuck. You look here, he just literally got stuck on his own line. And I had to get the ball off. He just got he got stuck on the defenders. He got stuck there, just got stuck, stuck, stuck all across the board. Oh, well, uh, let's go. We're behind the chains now. Uh, the downs. Let's go half back out. They're going zone. I will. I mean, we could try to go to Cooper over the middle. If they go soft cover two. They're going soft cover two. Terrible throw. Ah, oh, just a bad throw. Bad throw, Cooper. Bad throw by Ricard. He overshot it big time here. You go back and look. I didn't do any English. I rarely, if ever, do that. And he just, he overshot it so badly. Another turnover. So Ricard is just, he's just not doing good. But let's go cover two man. They went soft cover two, so I didn't mind the, the decision. Just my quarterback's got to make a better throw. Somebody get a stop. Pick up easy eight yards there. And we'll just stay in cover two man. Second and two coming up here. Ball on their own 40. Single set back. I assume they will run it. Well, their impact guy's not even back there. We're going to play action. I'm, I'm going to go back. Oh, wheel route. Had him beat badly, but it was a bad throw. So it is goal line time. We're going to go goal line defense. We're going cover. They're going goal line themselves. We do something like this. That's their strength. It would be amazing if we can get a stop here. Ooh, went the other way with a fullback. But he didn't get it. <laughs> he didn't get it. What a great stop here by the defensive line. I think a linebacker came through. Nowhere to go. Huge play. I was not expecting that. Wow, we forced a punt. Uh, let's do an all-out block. I, they may come in to protect on this one. I hope they don't. We can try a block. They're coming in to protect. So we dodged another bullet. It's just our offense. If we can just not turn the ball over. I almost could have blocked that. Uh, we're going to fair catch that one. 
And they make the fair catch. So they got a weaker, if you go back and look at their safeties, they got a weaker free safety. If I'm not mistaken. You go here, 72 and 87. We need to attack that guy right there as best we can. Oh, that's mine. <laughs> I'm an idiot. It's 78 for their free safety and 88 for theirs. So, yeah, let's go after their free safety. We're in the middle of the field, so let's try a deep cross up and we'll flip it. And they're going man, so we'll probably just run this. Uh, we'll just do something like that. Uh, just run as fast as you can, Ricard. Go, go, go. Just get out of bounds. Dodged a bullet there. Uh, let's go. I don't know if we should even bother going with bigger sets and trying to run it. I don't know if this will work at all. I'm not a big fan of that shift. The clock has stopped. We'll just go to the right. Oh, just couldn't find a crease right there, but we got out of the ball. Out of it somehow. Ended up being a big play. Second and two. We can stay here and we can try a toss. Second and two coming up here. Ball the Not a big fan of that shift. Not kind of well. I don't know. We may be able to make that work. The clock has stopped, so we can go ahead and run this one. Good block there. Great play, everybody. Good job, everybody. So let's go. Uh, first and ten. Everybody's still feeling kind of fresh. Let's go trips over. Uh, where's it at? Uh, no, let's go gun spread trips. I'm not going to do the PE read. Uh, where's it at? I, we'll do Y stick. It's first and We're ten. going zone. Right around midfield. I will probably keep this simple and just go to Forte. The green wave. Come out the shotgun. Do something like this. He's he wide open too. Just a bad throw. Incomplete. Bad throw by Ricard. Uh, second and ten. Is he gassed? No, he's feeling okay. Uh, let's go here. Just want to make sure. Uh, let's do direct. Maybe we can catch him off guard. They're going man nickel, but he's coming down. That was my worry. And I don't have an audible for that one. Maybe we can catch them. Oh, he spread out even more, but he got caught right there. Good deal. We got lucky. The right tackle done a great job. I was for sure thought that defensive end was coming around. So here we are. We're still kind of in it. Uh, Halfback screen. They're going man. We're going to go to somebody on the left. Looks like we will go, I think, that free safety is on Cooper. If he's on Cooper and they go cover zero, we're going to him. Otherwise, we're going to Gidros. Let's snap it. The clock has stopped. Cover one, no, but it's the linebacker. Great play to Gidros. Didn't get the first, but that's okay. Second and inches. I am. I'm gonna try a double screen again. This time they're going man. And what worries me here is who is on who. We're gonna go to Cooper. Hopefully that linebacker doesn't mess us up. Hopefully not. I could go to Forte, but normally these plays work better. That screen to the halfback works better if it's against zones. Let's go ahead. It's not on him. Great play. Six points. Great blocking. Great blocking by everybody. Awesome to see that. Let's see if we can get a decent replay before I show you what happened here. Very up close and personal on the replay. Let's go back and look at it. If I can get to it. All right. We have this guy going out here. That's our man beater. And we got a halfback over here. That's our zone beater. Well, they're going man. And I was worried that this guy was going to be on him, but it wasn't. I think he was on our halfback. So I think it was our, either this guy or this guy that was on him. We're about to find out. We're going to snap the ball. It looks like it was this linebacker who was on him. But it doesn't matter because if you look over here, this is one of my creative plays. I know this only helps people who have actually uh, are using the emulator. Just a great block by Batiste. And there was just all kinds of daylight over the top. Incredible. Incredible. Great play. Now we're up. Four points. Fixing to be. I was not expecting him to be with that one open, so I guess that play design worked like it was supposed to. Let's kick an extra point. So somehow, some way, we got the lead with two turnovers in this quarter. But our defense is playing really well at the moment. 
Okay, got an impact guy on the right. We're going to kick it over here. And that's going to the impact guy. I hit the button too early. But I think he'll take a knee. We're definitely going to miss Beckman next year. He's been so good for us, punting and kicking. I'm going to go man cover two. Do something like this. Uh, uh, dang it. I could have messed that one up. Oh, I just that could have been really bad. He went for the SWAT. You go back and look at this. This play rarely works for the CPU, but our defender over there went for the SWAT. And he misjudged it big time. Ended up being just a great play for their quarterback. I'm gonna stay in man. First and ten. Ball on their own thirty-five. And I'm I'm not I'm not supposed to be controlling the free safety. <laughs> I don't need to be doing that. I keep forgetting. It didn't make a difference. All right, we're up seven to three at the end of the first. That's crazy. I'm going to try a zone blitz. I'm going to take a real chance here. I'm going to say they're going to play action on us. They're going strong. Ooh, they're going split. It's not strong. It's split. This one's kind of tough to blitz against. Yep. Huge push off the right side. And this is what's going to happen is everybody and their brother, especially on these max sliders, everybody and their brother got to push. Everybody. I mean, like, they're up five yards past the line. Just... It is what it is with that. Uh, let's try. Let's go quarters. First and ten. Ball on the forty-eight. Penn State lines up with three receivers. Do something like this. Pass. Oh, he's wide open over there. Oh, he, he dropped it. Thank the Lord. I couldn't get there over there in time. I think they're going to run it here. I'm going to stay in cover two man. It's second down and ten to go. This is the fifth play of this drive. Morelli comes to the line. There's something like this. Good play by somebody came through. I don't know who. It just came right on through. Went by the tight end. Great play, 57. So that makes it what? Third and nine. Oh my gosh, can we get a stop here? That'd be great. I'm gonna go after him. I assume they are going to pass. They got everybody and their brother on this side. Intercept that. Oh my gosh, I should have been picked, but great play. Nonetheless, we're going to force another punt. I'm going to go all that block. Do something like this. Somebody get through. Oh, nobody took a chance on it. There was That was super close. Everybody get away from it. You go back and look at this. Look how close this was. Eh, maybe it wasn't so close. It looked very close. No wonder nobody really took a chance there. So we're in the middle of the field. Again, I'm going to try that deep cross up. And they're back to playing man again. And they're shifting that way. Uh, I'm just going to run with it. It's just easier to do this. Great play by Ricard. Now we can stay here. Let's go QB choice. Zone dime. Just don't shift super hard to the right. Even better. All this gaping hole up here on that side. Great play all around. It helps that they had everybody and their brother over here. Left in a huge gaping hole over here. As long as we made our blocks, we was going to get a decent gain. So I just handed the ball off to Williams. And great block there by Batiste. Just a great, great block all around. Good run. Awesome. First and 10. Uh, let's go. I want to keep spreading them out. I want to see if we can keep their... Uh, let's go. Let's go slot cross. Let's go after that free safety. We're gonna play pretty aggressive on this one. If we can get past this, I'm gonna bring him over. Uh, no, fix the get hit. Intercepted. We got just very lucky. They got a whole lot of pressure on me on the quarterback. That linebacker was coming through. I couldn't stop and throw it. I was gonna get sacked. So we're very fortunate this wasn't intercepted. Very fortunate. Second and ten. Let's go speed option. 
They're blitzing at least that guy on the right. Uh, is that number? I don't know what's. I don't know who's on who. We're gonna try this though. We're gonna go here. He hesitated. He hesitated. Hesitated. Get a first down, Williams. Huh. Great play. Let's give everybody a bit of a break. Let's run a basic slam, and then we're gonna do play action off of this. We're going zone four three. We're gonna definitely run to the left. And the clock has stopped. I'm gonna go ahead and snap this thing. Great play by that linebacker. Nowhere to go. So now we're gonna try that play action. We're gonna go this screen play. PA screen. We're going man, so we're not gonna attack that safety. But we'll go to one of the receivers on this one. Let's run the clock some before we figure out what to do on third down. I'd love to see both safeties come down. I'd love to go to Gedros in the corner of the end zone. If not, we will go underneath to Brown. Cover zero. Kind of, sort of. Perfect throw. Wow, that was a perfect throw. And this was kind of a weird play. That strong safety. I couldn't tell if he was going to stay down, stay low. I think the play action just kind of threw him off a little. But he wasn't fast enough to get over there in time. Just a great play. An absolute dime of a throw. So let's go back and look at this. This is the PA screenplay where I have a, a go route and I got like a crosser over here and I have a screen over here in case they went zone, but we're going, they went man. So I was going to one of the wide receivers and you notice here, uh, I knew this safety, he was coming down. It just depended on what this safety was going to do. If he was going to go up over here quickly, I was going to go over to the crosser. But instead what he done, when you snap the ball, he kind of stops right here. He just kind of stops, and I guess the play action kind of confused him a little bit. He just kind of stays put, and it'd be super hard for him to come all the way over here to try to make a play. He tried, but it wasn't enough. We had good protection, go over the top, and it just wasn't enough for him to get over there. And look at this. Die, just an incredible throw right here to Gidros. Incredible. Great play. This could be probably a thumbnail opportunity something like that that looks really cool awesome guess what we're up 10 fix to go up 11. somehow again we got two turnovers and somehow we're up 10. our defense though they're really stepping up which gives me hope even more about not wanting to touch the sliders you know when i see that because they're they got an impact running back he's making some decent plays here and there but every now and then we can kind of get through just up and down so far on that front. This is going back to the impact guy, I'm afraid. Hey, it may curl in, and it's not going to matter. He's going to take a knee. I am going to go man. I think they're going to run it. Start this drive. We'll keep a 4-3 in there. Do something like this. The uh, they normally run this direction, if so. Let's try that. We're going to pass. Good throw to the tight end. Pick up, what, six yards, five? Uh, I, I think they're going to run. So we'll stay in, man. I'm going to shift him over. Big gaping hole. Somebody get a tackle. Somebody tackle. Get about 14 yards there. I'm going to stay in the same thing until they force me to practically go 4-4. I don't think I'll have to. We'll see what they do here. I think they're going to run it. Yep. Oh, I went the wrong direction. No, I didn't. End ended up getting the tackle. Good job. <laughs> you kind of have to pick which direction you're going to go to because there's not a whole lot of time to decide on that. I think they're going to go play action here. So I'm going to try his own blitz. Please don't run it. <laughs> the Nittany Lions go with the I formation. I beg you, do not run it. Up the gut. Perfect call. Thankful we got him down before he hit the third, the uh, first down marker. It's third and two, and they're going. We're going to go cover one. Oh, I forgot to put. I got to call a timeout. I'm going to call a timeout. I got to get Gooseby in there. This is an important play. Uh, 
now they're doing that. Um, well, that was a waste of time out. I thought they were going to go back to a bigger set. We could try Clown. Let's see if they throw it. Do something like this. Amp basic run up the gut. Just nobody touched him for 15 yards. I didn't know what they was going to call there, honestly. Now they're on the 39. I'm going to go back to a zone blitz. This may be really dumb. But they may just want to continue to run it. I'm going to try this, though. I'm going to take a chance. Oh, get him, get him, get him. Great play. Great play, everybody. Second and 13, and they called a timeout. I'm going to go quarters. I almost wanted the blitz there, but I want to have a chance for a third down play. They ran the ball. Wasn't expecting that. First down. Was not expecting that whatsoever. Okay. I'm going to try another zone blitz. I don't know. I mean, their play con's been pretty good, I guess. It's confusing me. Do something like this. I'm going to... I got pushed around way too easily there. Just now he's just bouncing off everybody. <laughs> that's the impact halfback in him. So now they're just going to run, run, run. Okay, that's fine. Let's just go goal line. Minute 30. If they're smart, they'll just run to the right. They're passing. And he overshot it. Second and goal. They're going back to goal line. And they have their strength on that side. So let's do that and see what happens. They went that direction, but nobody can make a play. So the play call was correct. Just nobody could get off the block. Now it is 14 to soon to be 10. A minute 24. We'll try our best not to do anything goofy here. I'd love to score. But I don't want them to get a quick score either. Off a bad turnover or what have you. Minute 54 off that drive. That's a good drive for them. They just ran the ball a whole lot more than I expected. I don't know. It was two-minute drill. I just kind of assumed they was going to try to quickly get down the field. But they didn't have to. They just went to their running back the entire time. Uh, I'm going to let that one go. Now, I've been trying to do deep cross-up all day, and they keep going man against it. We can try it again. I'm going to go up against that free safety. Again, they're going man. I wonder if, if he can hear that. I think he can. We're going to get him out of the way. Not feeling a whole lot of heat. Let's go this way. Good play there. Uh, first and 10. We're on the right hash. we got to get down the field a little bit. Now I'm kind of thinking maybe a touchdown is possible. We're going zone. Last time we called this, it did not go well at all. Let's just see how big their pass rush is. We're going to bring him over. Another high snap does not help things. Oh, this ain't... Shoo. Very lucky. Very lucky that wasn't intercepted. Okay, second and ten. Let's think a little bit. Uh, let's go tight end dig. The going man 4-3. I'm going to have him do something like that. I'd rather have Gidros go over the top, to be honest. Let's do this. Cover zero. I got to take the chance. Let's go, Gidros. Get it. Get it. Ah, oh, great play. Great play. Run some clock. Run some clock. Six points. Huge. Big play. That was a great throw. They brought both safeties. We can get a couple replays here. King just could not do it. He couldn't make a play on it. I tried to run a little clock there. I didn't know how far away we were from everybody. So you go back and look at this. Now, they went 4-3. So what I always usually do against when they're going man is I motion the wide receiver over because I want this guy to defend him because it just takes him longer to go over there and cover him. But they brought both safeties, giving me a chance to go over the top to our impact wide receiver. You snap the ball, both safeties come down, and then it's just all she wrote after that. Just a great play to the big guy, Gidros. 
Making plays out there today. Really cool. Wow. And we scored a lot quicker than I expected. Uh, so they got a full minute to go. But at least now I think they're going to pass on this drive a whole lot more. And he hits the PAT. So we will act accordingly. So their defense has been extra aggressive. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Throwing just enough cover zero at us. But we're taking advantage of it. He's going to return this one. This can get iffy. Get over here. It ain't going to matter. Great play by you know who Goosby made the tackle. Let's go quarters. We're going to try to keep everything in front of us. I think this quarterback's finally going to start slinging around some. I think. Went run. Was okay. That's fine. Just a great play. Somebody came through, and that was a halfback direct. No, that wasn't. That was halfback dive. I'm sorry. Ah. Let's go man. I think they're going to run the rest of the way. Otherwise, they would have called a timeout and tried to do something quickly, but they didn't. Let's do this. I think they've conceded. They're ready to go to the half. I don't know who gets the ball in the third quarter. I, I forgot. I think they do. Look at that. Great stop. Who came through? Somebody did. I didn't do anything special in terms of... Everybody got a decent push, but we had a couple of guys come through. One guy came through real easy. Peterson, somehow. He was just feeling that, I don't know, just came right on through. Awesome play. The defense comes up with a good play to pull him down for a loss. I am. It's like he's in their huddle sometimes. I was about to call a timeout, maybe try to get the ball back, but I don't think that's a good idea. So we'll just do this. I think they're going to run it again. with three wide receivers. And they got to snap it, so that we got one play left. Everybody make a good decision. They keep it on the ground with the Just, oh, you gotta be kidding. At the point, across midfield, at the All of that for nothing. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Just way too, I mean, just, he broke tackles. He jumped over a guy, which is pretty incredible. Just a great play by them. Well, what do you do? And... That gets the lead down to four, essentially. That was a huge play for them. I got them back in it. Easily. And he down the Let's go to the stats. Well, it's halftime officially now. And we've reached half time. 21 to 17. You go to stats and scores. 264 to their 210. Everything's been in their run game. They haven't had one passing yard the entire game so far. I guess that's why maybe we're leading. I don't know. Uh, our passing's gone really well. It's been pretty efficient. Our run game's gone well, too. We haven't had one third down yet today, which is interesting. They're 40%. We have two turnovers. I guess we'd be up even more if we didn't have that bad start in the first quarter. Go to individual stats. You look at their running... Tony Hunt, 190 yards, two touch. He's got 190 yards already. I mean, he's on the verge of getting 400 yards. And he's got four broken tackles so far. Now let's go back and look at ours. Uh, Ricard, 7-12, 150 yards, three touchdowns already. And he's got the one pick. I forgot what that pick looked like. Oh, yeah, it was like over the middle where he just overshot it. Running the ball, uh, Williams has got 54. Ricard's got 41 and a poor Forte. Just he's, His average is pretty decent, so we may need to try to give him the ball more, I guess, through the ground or on the ground. Uh, Gidros, four receptions, 116 yards, two touchdowns. Cooper has got a touchdown. Uh, defensively, Gooseby, of course, is leading in tackles. Always does. Harrison, Peterson, and Foreman on the tackles for loss. No sacks because they don't throw enough. And uh, no interceptions. And just what I thought. I thought they was going to get the ball start of the third quarter. So this is a big opportunity for them to get the lead. I'm going to kick it over here. He's going to return to Danny, and he will. Oh, good juke, but didn't really have anywhere to go. Let's go cover two man. Do something like this. Here's a 
Haas. I can't get over there in time. Great tackle by Smith. Great, great tackle. Uh, I'm going to stay in man. I think they'll run it again. We're going to bring these guys over. Pass. Get him, get him. Somebody get him. Anybody. Overshot it just enough. He had him beat, too. Third and ten. We're going to go cloud. Would be an amazing stop if we can get this one executed well. Let's do something like this. At least I don't have a whole lot of barriers of entry on this side. Intercept that. Ooh, he almost caught it. <laughs> Great play by the corner. Great play. He got a... I thought Derek Williams was going to catch this. I thought right here. Look at that. Great play by our corner. Just like that, they're going to punt it. Great stop. So we can get back on offense and capitalize on that. The Nittany Lions line up to punt. Punts the ball away. Mm, I'm going to fair catch that one. I don't see a lot of opportunities there. Let's go back and... Uh, let's go... Where's it at? We're going to go halfback screen. I'm not exactly in the middle of the field or on the right half, so I don't know if this is going to work all that great or not. What I am going to try, I'm going to bring another dude over to help us out. Don't know if it will help. Good block. Just, yeah, I'm going to get out of bounds. Just get away from that linebacker. Good play there. Uh, let's go here. Let's pass it. The going man. Good. We're going to go right back to Gidros. They never go cover zero against this play. So I guarantee you that's where we're going to go. Now let's go ahead and snap it. As I predicted, great throw. Good job by both parties. Uh, let's stay here. Go QB choice. This will more than likely be a handoff. And they're going man dime even better. Just don't shift hard. Uh, uh. I may keep this with Gidget, with Ricard, honestly. That shift, that worries me. And so we're just going to have to read the line, and I'm think I'll just keep this with Ricard. Yeah, just that could have been a disaster if we would have handed the ball off. That linebacker was going to blow up Forte. So that was a good read. Now, unfortunately, th this play goes by so quickly, you can't just read the linebacker. I, I don't have the quickness for it. Somebody probably can. Unfortunately, it's not this slow. It's super fast. You kind of have to make up your mind pre-snap. So that could have been bad, but it wasn't terrible either. Second and eight. I want to keep him out there. Let's go tight end dig. It's second down and eight to go. And they're going zone. Mm, let's go ahead and snap it. Wide open, the tight end. First down. Zone beaters. What we have here, we got two of them to be exact. We have this guy doing a dig, and we got, like, this guy doing an out route. If there is a hole right here against zone, I am going to the tight end, and that's exactly what happened. So you zoom in here. You notice there's a big gaping hole above your center. I'm just waiting for him to make his cut, get away from that linebacker, and boom. First down. Great play to the tight end. So we are on the left, hash. Uh, let's spread them out. Let's go speed option. Man dime. The linebackers are on at defensive end this time. They've been doing that a couple times today. That's just a sub package. I'm going to bring this guy over. We're going to run to the right. Let's go ahead and snap it. I'm keeping this. Ooh, I didn't mean to do that. I forgot that's a fake pitch. That's good defense. Their pursuit was pretty spectacular there. So that's second and 10. I am. I'm going to go. I have an idea. I'm going to go. We're going to try slot cross again. It hasn't worked any today. But I'm going to go after that free safety. This may be a good time to try. They are going zone. I like that shift. Let's go over here. Uh, I got enough time to throw. I guess I don't. Wow, just great pursuit. I couldn't get it off in time. I thought he was going to get it off. You see, you're like, okay, this is just, it, this is video game stuff right here. Look, the ball is, he should have thrown it right here. He hasn't even been touched yet. That's an animation flaw. That's video game stuff. 
We're lucky that's a drop or an incompletion, I guess. Third and forever. Uh, hiding cross. Third and ten. Ball on the third I got to be very careful. The last time we called this play, we threw an interception, but our best opportunity to get a first down is over the middle. Unless they go cover three, we can go to our tight end. Let's try the Esther going cover two. Fumble. Wow, just another fumble. I had no time to throw it. Absolutely no time. They blitz off the outside. Just their pressure's killer. I had no time to do anything there. That's three turnovers. Just a tough play, but you know, what do you do? Let's do something like this. But if he were my quarterback and came to me with an excuse, he would have heard the old saying. All day to the, over there. And and this is touchdown. Just like that. All it took was one play. Good block by the halfback right here. Pitch, and he gets a block right there. And guess what? He gets another block. Just a killer play. Nothing you can do, though. And just like that, they got the lead. That's why you don't need to turn the ball over. They'll score on it. So we'll get back and try to figure out how to not turn the ball over. Just a bad quarter. But it's not over with yet. We still got a half of it left. Uh, let's see if Batiste can do something. Get a block, somebody. Left hash, uh, we can try. Let's do a toss. We're going man. I love the shift. Ooh, I probably could have treated this as an option. He's just not fast enough, unfortunately. Great play, though. He just don't have any top end speed. Good run there. He's kind of gas, kind of sort of. So let's just throw the ball. Zone dime, we're going back to stick. Let's run some clock. I hope my hitch, my stick route is open. If not, it's going to be a real tight throw to Williams. I need to turn that to a swing. He's wide open. Good deal. Get about five yards there. That's the whole point of stick. You go back and look at this. The whole point of stick is it's just triangle read. You got to go route. You got a little hitch here, and then you got like a flare. The whole point of this is to drag this defender over to leave your stick open. And that's what happened, from what I could tell. You snap the ball, he goes over, and this guy has a decision to make. Does he go here, or does he go here? Thankfully, this guy was more open. So we just threw it to him. Pick up five yards. Good play. Let's throw a direct at him. It's zone dime. I just don't know how they're going to react to this. I like the shift. I may bring an extra block or something like this. As long as we don't get a high snap, I think we'll be okay. But can our right tackle do his thing against that impact linebacker? And he can. Good deal. We're going to go around this way. Good play there. And I need to make a, hold on, I, I got to pause it real quick. I'm so sorry. I'm going to do this. I have to make an adjustment. We're going to go properties. I'm going to take my cursor off. I, I need to take that off. I, I don't think it's going to matter. Sometimes I forget to keep it on there. I think I'll just leave it. That's okay. All right. I'm sorry about that. All right, let's go into it. First and 10. Let's go here. Uh, no, I'm going to go back. I'm going to go, let's do this screen. First and 10. Man 4-3. I'm quite positive that linebacker is going to head over and to maybe defend Cooper. And he is. So we're going to go to Gidros, which I'm fine with. He, he's making his plays. Just keep throwing him the ball. I'm going to keep doing that. We're going tiny and dig, and they're going man. I dare them to go cover zero because we will go over the top on that one. Now, I will probably... Uh, who's on who? I think... I am going to bring this guy over. I'd rather 20 to be on Forte than the impact linebacker, but it's not a guarantee that he is on him. So let's go over here. He drops back. He gets rid of it 
good defense. We got some yards out of it, but they had a bunch of bodies sitting there, kind of waiting on a third and inches. Oh, let's go half back out. Oh, they're going zone. Hopefully we can make a simple throw. DeForte, hopefully he can get through there. I would love to just run it. I just don't I just don't trust us in that situation. Their defensive line, especially with those linebackers in there, are better than our offensive line. Let's go ahead and snap it. E, good play. Good job, Ricard. Easy first down. That's how you convert on third down. This defense he is gassed. Uh, let's try. I feel like we got to keep spreading it out just to keep it away from. I'm just trying to find ways to make their linebackers really work for it. Let's go white corner. Zone nickel. This will either go to Brown or to Williams, depending on what those linebackers do. Uh, it looks like I have no choice but to throw this. Not a whole lot there. The pass wasn't all that great. So that wasn't a very good quarter. We had turnovers. We just couldn't capitalize on anything, really. And we're down three. But we're still down three, so this is nowhere near over. Uh, let's go. Let's do a speed option with Forte. Ah, they're going 4-3 zone. That don't help much of anything. We're going to go to the right, apparently. Good blocking everybody. Everybody blocked. Everybody blocked well on that one. That should give us a first down, shouldn't it? Oh, we didn't get the first? Oh, my gosh. We didn't even get the first. I'm going to try. We're going to go slam. Interesting. We're going to go to the left. The clock has stopped, too. Just get out of the way, everybody. Just don't fumble it. <laughs> Great play. Ah. Crazy. But we ran the ball well, somehow. Now he's really gassed. Look at him. He's about to pass out. Uh, let's go. I feel like we got to keep... I'm trying to make sure these those uh, those linebackers... Both of them have been staying on the field all day. Most part. I figured every now and then they would take one of them out. They're going zone. We're going to keep this simple. We'll go to Ryder Cooper. Let's run as much clock as possible. Get it down to a few seconds. Drop back to pass. We'll just go over here. I just uh, get in there. <laughs> Somehow he got in there. I thought he got stuck and had no chance to get in. But ended up he was able to. I tried my best to get up field as quickly as possible. Great play to Cooper. It was a good looking throw, but he just got stuck on that flat route, which sometimes will happen. And just like that, we're back up three. Let's go up four if we can get an extra point. go here all right back to defense we know what they're going to do they're going to go to their running back and i don't blame them we'll try to find a way to corral that let's do something like this i think i kicked it too hard and yeah that wind i forgot about that wind and you know the wind hasn't really affected our deep ball lane or anything i mean we've been able to Make plays off of that. But the wind affected that one. But that was my fault. I kicked it too. Hit the button too late. It's going to get a really good field position. I'm going to go man, though. Do something like this. I went the wrong way. Good job, man. I was able to recover from that. So he didn't get anywhere. I'm I'm still staying in man. I think they're going to run it. I want to stay in 4-3. I'm going to do something like this, though. I do not want him to run off tackle. And they're going halfback dive. But great stop by the defensive end. So it's, what, third and five? Third and six. I think they're going to throw it. So that's the chance we will take. But it wouldn't shock me if they ran it either. Penn State goes with the ace set here. Make a play, somebody. Great play. Huge play. Good stop right there. We forced a punt. Well, 
So 345 to go. Let's run as much clock as we can by still getting down the field. If we can get one more touchdown, that would really make things easier. That's a terrible punt, but I think it's coming right back in. We're going to have to fair catch it. Back on the right hash. Let's go to Gidros. You're going man. We'll, very good chance we'll go to Gidros. I don't know if Cooper can hear this. I mean, I can have Williams, but he can't hear that. So I'm going to let that one be. Uh, we'll just go over here to Gidros. Off the back foot. Oh, my gosh. I threw it off the back foot. That was going to be intercepted. That's why he threw it short. I didn't mean to do that. I, I guess I was feeling that he got nervous. shoo Great play to Gidros. First and ten. Uh, let's do speed option. They're blitzing the right nickel, but who is on the other slot? That guy. So it's cover zero, and I don't have, I don't have the quick audible. I should have done a quick audible. That's okay. We're gonna go to the left. I think we're gonna be okay. It just depends on what that linebacker is gonna do right there. I hope our left guard can pick him up. I snap. Dang it! That did not help anything. Let's just get down. I don't want that guy to force a fumble. Bad play there. Second and eight. Uh, let me think. Let's go back to a toss. And I may treat this as an option instead of a toss. Not a big fan of that shift. Um, and they're going cover zero to boot. This could be really bad. It all depends on what that linebacker is going to do. But I feel like I got no choice but to go left. And just don't, just great defense all around. Just great play. Uh, now it's third and eight. I am going to go cross post. They're going zone. I done cross post because I got a good deep man beater and a good zone beater if they don't blitz hard on that right side. If we get a, any decent amount of protection on the right side, I'm going to try to hit Cooper. If not, we may have to go over the top, over the middle. Not feeling a whole lot of heat. Great play to Cooper. Huge play right there. Huge. Man, that really made a difference. Thankfully, we weren't feeling a whole lot of heat. We can look at this again. I had, uh, let's see, I had pretty much, I had like a post like here. This is a flag route. Uh, this is, I think, a, a drag of some sort. And I had a deep dig like this, but they're going zone. I'm all about going to this guy right here in that corner. They went cover two, which is what I wanted to see. And I didn't feel a whole lot of pressure coming down here. I know that's a ton of arrows, but rolling out the right tackle couldn't make a stop there, but I was able to get away from him just in time to throw it to the freshman in Cooper. Great play. Play of the game so far. Uh, Forte is kind of gassed. Uh, so let's do... I have an idea. Let's go QB choice. I'm just going to do a handoff with Williams until Forte gets rested. That shift is not good at all. Uh, I may just keep it with the quarterback, honestly. Oh my gosh, what a play! What a play by Ricard! <laughs> what a play! This is really weird play. So I did not want to hand the ball off. I didn't even do any pre-snap. I thought everybody and their brother was going to come through here and just make a killer stop. We can see here we had good blocking. And it just I had to take a chance either way with that. So I kept it with Ricard, but somehow he got out of this mess. An impact broke tackle, a good block right there, and somehow we got seven yards out of it, or eight yards. Just really weird. I'm going to do a basic run for now with Forte. They're going man. 4-3. That clock is still... They, they'd call the timeout. I did not even pay attention to that. All right, we're going to go to the left. And they're going cover zero. First down. Now they're going to call another timeout. A minute 31. We're going to go offensive line. Uh, my line, my yes, my fullback is better than the other tight end. So let's just keep him in there. Let's do a halfback read. 
kind of similar to the halfback slim, but just a little bit slower, but you can really develop your run, your blocking. I love the shift. We're going to go to the right. The clock it stops. Let's snap it. I thought that linebacker coming through was going to make a play there. Second and seven. He is about gassed, so I have to. I'm going to give him a break. I'm going to go half back direct on him. They're going zone dime. But they got those edge guys sitting there waiting on it. Uh, so what I'm going to do, the shortest distance between two points is a straight line. So we're going to go to the right side. It's going to be a little quicker. I'm going to bring in an extra blocker, something like this. Hopefully that'll help. Snap it. No high snap. And Brown made a huge play, and that is the ball game right there. Maybe. Hopefully. Huge play. Wow. Just a killer block by Brown off the edge. I don't know if they're going to show in this replay. They may. Yeah, they barely showed it. Going around. Oh, my gosh. That was an amazing play. We're up 10. Fix to go up 11. So, you know they're going to throw it the rest of the way. So, we're going to keep a soft coverage, keep everything in front of us. I don't think their quarterback's good enough just to wing it around all day and make plays on us. I don't think. Now, he's got the arm for it. We just haven't seen any of it because they've ran the ball so much. Huge drive. Humongous drive. We're going to kick this like normal. Because, well, I short-armed it a little bit or short-legged it. <laughs> Our punters are as a huge weapon, so I want them to go the full length of the field. And they're going to go 80 yards. 49 seconds. We'll go quarters at a 4-3, only because our, our nickel situation or our, our cornerback situation isn't all that great. We've had so many injuries. We're down to next to nothing there. Our linebacking crew isn't the best either. And ball game. Interception. And that is it. Huge play by Smith. He just caught in front of it. Either that or the quarterback just made a bad throw. This ain't going to really show it towards the very end like that. But I think he just overshot it just enough. You go back and look at this. I think what happened is I think Smith got in front of it. Just enough. Oh, yeah. Incredible. And just like that, we're going to get a big upset. 46 seconds. Uh, let's just keep it simple. Let's do a let's do a counter. Man nickel. Are they out of timeouts? I think they're out of timeouts. Uh, we'll go to the right. We got one timeout. That's it for them. 43 seconds. So we're going to go. We're going to take a knee the rest of the way. And that should be able to seal this thing. It's going to go... We're going to snap it here. And we're going to do another kneel down. And yes, I think we'll be good. Awesome. I just wasn't expecting this. I mean, after all the turnovers we had, but our defense, I thought, played really well. Yes, their halfback had some big plays a time or two. But their passing game was non-existent. Our secondary played fantastic today. Their quarterback did not play well. I thought he just made one bad throw after another. One more snap on to do it. And there's your ball game. Wow, we're going to finish the season 8-4, and four, just like last year. So it's really weird. We had six straight wins, four straight losses, and then two straight wins. And now we got a ball game, or uh, we got a bowl game to play. Wow. We went up to Happy Valley and got the upset. Incredible. I know they were 5-5, five and five, but still, they're a better team than us, talent-wise. There's old Joe Paterno. All right, let's look at some stats. Should be some fun things to see there. Oh, wow. Good to see us getting the win column a time or two. It's been a while. 440, they're just they're 272, and you look here. They had... All of their yards came from the running game. Their passing game, they had a grand total of 20 yards. Three of 12. He just played terrible today. But again, I think our secondary help there, just uh, getting in front of things, getting interceptions and such, because you, let's see, our third down looked really good. Theirs was bad. Turnovers, hour three to their one. If you'd have told me 
that stat line, I would assume we would have got beat, but we overcame it somehow. Uh, let's look at the individual stuff. Uh, Ricard, 18-24, 249 yards, four touchdowns, and he had the one interception. But otherwise, he, he played really well today running the ball. Ricard ended up with 47 yards. He had 12 attempts. I didn't expect him to run the ball that much. It just kind of worked out that way. His average isn't all that great, but he produced when he needed to. Williams had a good game, 92 yards. Forte, done fine. Receiving, Gidros had his best game of his career. I think he caught everything thrown his direction. I don't think he had one drop. Yeah, not one, not a single drop. Seven receptions, 147 yards, two touchdowns. Cooper had two touchdowns. You go to defense, Harrison Gooseby. Again, Gooseby, your leading uh, tackle or tackler. Tackles for loss. Uh, nothing changed after that first half there. No sacks and one interception by Larry Smith, our true freshman, in the end. Just insane. All right, let's get out of here. And what we're going to do is I will probably, in the next video, you will see all the simulation stuff at the beginning. That way you don't miss out the Heisman thing and the awards and such. We're going to go here. We are going to simulate, like, we got to buy. What we can do is simulate up to week 15. We don't need to see anything week 15. There's not many teams that play anyways. So let's do that. What's going to happen is they are going to uh, open up the conference championship week, which doesn't affect us. We couldn't get in there in time. We just had too many losses towards the end. But you're not going to miss anything, or it's not going to jump ahead to something that's really important like the Heisman and such. That'll be the week after your conference championship week. So let's go ahead and just send that. And again, not just nothing really happens in week 15. So there you go. We are in the conference championship week. And what we can do, I don't know if it's really worth it to look at the top 25 scores. I don't think I'm really going to. So what we're going to do is in our next game, we're going to simulate this week together. And then we're going to go play our bowl game, whoever that's going to be. And we're also going to do the off-season with that video. So that's going to be another really long video. That's just kind of the way I want to do that. But that'll probably be the week after when I do that. All right. That was a whole lot of fun. I hope you enjoy that. And I'll talk to you later.